Anyone who's tried to fly FPV on the same band as another pilot can tell you it's extremely difficult, if not completely impossible. Yet flying tandem with another pilot is one of the most fun things we can do in FPV. Whether it's just chasing each other low altitude over a field, or racing our quads as fast as they can go around pylons and through obstacles, one of the most fun things we can do in FPV is fly with other pilots. Well, that challenge just got easier. I'm Alex Grieve, better known as IV Crazy from Video Aerial Systems, and I bring you the Airblade left hand circularly polarized antenna system. The Airblade boasts an axial ratio of 0.77 and a gain of 1.5 dB. This makes it one of the best circularly polarized omni antennas on the market today. Now, the other great thing about the Airblade is that it's both a transmit and a receive antenna. It's the same antenna for both transmit and receive. No need for different antenna sets. Now the benefit of the Airblade is that it's left-handed. And as you know, left-handed antennas do not accept right-hand circular signals well. So let's say you and a friend want to go out and fly on the 1.3 gigahertz band. Well, if your friend is using a set of blue beams, then you can mitigate the interference from his channel by using a set of air blades. Now, let's say your friend's transmitting at, say, 500 milliwatts. Well, the air blade will receive that signal strength at only 30 milliwatts. This is an extreme reduction in interference. Now, mind you, you still need to use different channels but at least now you can share the band and fly together. You don't need to invest in a whole new frequency. You just need to change your antennas. Now this only works with high quality antennas with high axial ratio. This will not work with linear and this will not work with junk antennas. There's lots of junk knockoffs out there and they simply spam the band too much to allow this effect to happen. So you need good quality, high axial ratio antennas. Now what comes with an Airblade antenna set? Of course, you're going to get the Airblade antennas. You're going to get adapters for your antennas. And they also come with this torque wrench. The way this torque wrench works, install it on the SMA connector and tighten it down on your transmitter or your receiver until you feel it pop. Once it pops, you have achieved proper torque. This keeps you from over tightening and damaging your transmitter or receiver when tightening with pliers or under tightening and risking the antenna falling off in flight. I'm Alex Grieve from Video Aerial Systems and keep your wings in the sky.